I'd like to thank you uh, for your time today. My name is Major Jones with Texas Workforce Commission. I'd like to take a moment to discuss career exploration. Choosing a career is important, but it's more than just picking a desired occupation. Students should consider how the career they choose uh, will support their lifestyle. They should think about the amount of time spent at work, what they'll be doing in their career. Students will want to make sure that the career that they're choosing is a good fit for you. Most people need some preparation before they enter the world of work. Planning should start long before it's time to start their career. Students need to know the options that are available. What interests do you have? What, what are your skills? What areas do you need to develop? Students don't have to pick one occupation now. Explore the different careers that align with their interests, skills, and values, and understand the career pathways. This is the time to start developing the skills to translate their interests into satisfying careers. And students knowing their options will aid them in making an informed decision knowing the next step after high school. There will be a life after high school and it is important for students to think about their post-secondary life. There are options that some students may have not known about or thought were for them. Pursuing post-secondary education degrees or gaining career credentials improves their chances of earning a livable wage. Let's talk about the post-secondary options. Students who attend a four-year college or university earn bachelor's degrees by successfully completing a degree program. Texas Workforce Commission has a resource tool called Texas Career Check that will allow you to explore over 4,000 colleges and universities. These institutions vary in size, admission requirements, and the types of courses they offer. Many four-year colleges and universities also have graduate and professional schools. Students who attend two-year colleges earn an associate's degree. Individuals who earn an AA degree may later transfer credits to a four-year college or university. There are different types of two-year institutions. Public community colleges have an open admissions policy and junior colleges have admission requirements. Vocational and technical schools and programs offer education and training that specifically targeted special areas within the employment domain. Students can access programs focusing on different occupational areas. Career choices may require that students first obtain specialized training, occupational license, and credentials. Apprenticeship is an industry-driven, high-quality career path where employers can develop and prepare their future workforce, and students can obtain paid work experience, classroom instruction, mentorship, and portable credentials. Military careers are one way for students to gain the training and education they need without the expense because the military provides many training and educational options. Many students interested in joining the military will need to complete the ASVAB. Test results are very important because it will determine whether you can join the military service of your choice and which military jobs will be open to you. Choosing a career might be one of the most difficult decisions a student has to make, one which impact their lives. Students need to avoid choosing careers that are decided by others. They need to understand the volume of careers available. It may not be reasonable to expect children to know what they want to do for the rest of their lives. They need to understand themselves and how they relate to possible careers and create a plan to achieve their career goal. Students should be encouraged to guide and provide the tools and steps to encourage self-reflection, research and career exploration opportunities. When students are thinking about careers of their future, explore those that fit your interests, skills, and values. Knowing themselves is an important step that can help direct them in their career search efforts. A student's greatest chance for success will result from a very strong match between their interests, skills, and values. These are the activities you will do. When you find a job opportunity that suits your interests, you'll be able to speak with excitement and certainty about why you want that position and why you're such a great match for it. So skills are your abilities or talents or competencies or what you're able to do with them. For example, strong communication skills can be used to help you develop different competencies, such as dealing with difficult customers, selling, and public speaking. When considering a career and values, does the career have the salary you want? Will you enjoy performing that career? 
Is it in the location you want to live? One of the best ways to choose a career is by exploring your interests. Students who are undecided about their career interests should take the career interest survey to identify one or two career fields that would be a good fit. Studies have linked career interests to great job satisfaction and professional success. Students viewing their future careers through the lenses of the question, what do you want to be when you grow up, may find their choices limited. It puts a student in a position to identify a single career title, and they may only be familiar with careers held by people they come in contact with in their daily life. The question doesn't even allow for the idea of careers that students have never heard of or those careers that don't exist yet. So different questions should be asked of students to help guide them in this journey to discovering future careers to pursue. When the question is changed, students have an opportunity to understand and build their strengths, explore their interests, and empower themselves to solve problems that matter to them. What is something you do well? The skills students possess can help them succeed in their future. A student's talents and strengths can help them succeed in their chosen career. Students should ask themselves, what are they interested in? Identifying occupations that have tasks that are interesting to students will make the job more enjoyable and they will be more motivated to keep that job. They will also do a better job and are more likely to be promoted. What are you curious about? This question may lead students to identify careers where they research, investigate, and get to learn new and exciting things. Students who are curious do well in occupations that require problem solving. What do you enjoy doing? The activities a student enjoys doing in their free time can give insight into careers that would be satisfying, fulfilling, and fun. Asking students about problems they want to solve gives them a chance to reflect on their own values and priorities. This will allow students to weigh in on how they think they want to help change the world and the person they want to be. Think of the careers that are to students when the question changes. No longer will the students think of themselves as being able to do one thing, one career, one option. Once students have a sense of a few career paths they might be interested in, they should use credential sources such as the Texas Career Check to learn more about each career. So go to texascareercheck.com to explore your interests or to research occupations or colleges. Specifically, students should look up the following information about each career that they're interested in. Description and wages require preparation, education, certification and licensing, typical daily activities, values and skills required, labor statistics, such as the job outlook, to determine if there will likely be jobs in that field available in the future. Focus and career exploration on the industry lets students find your interests and opportunities in their area of interest and opens possibilities that they may never have connected. Researching by industry also allows students to learn which industries are growing, hire the most employees, and pay the best, all of which means more career opportunities for them, not just now, but when they're ready to advance in their careers. Students should find ways to further explore their career interests by gaining hands-on experience and getting to know people who have those careers. Students can gain experience by conducting informal interviews with those in the careers of interest, job shadowing to see what a day on that job looks like, touring a facility to get the sense of the workplace environment, participating in activities related to their career interests. Students should meet with their school counselor to make the appropriate steps to plan their future. Selecting high school classes that offer options for exploring future careers while earning credit towards graduation. Some of these options also allow students to earn industry credentials, license, or college credit. Students can complete an internship or an apprenticeship. They are excellent ways to gain experience. Students can apply for part-time jobs or perform community service within their career cluster in order to gain experience and a better understanding of the field of interest. The LMCI Career Information Hotline provides career-free information to Texas students. Students calling during non-business hours may leave a request 
on the voicemail. It is important to note that the career planning process never ends. At various points in the person's career, they may be seeking additional training that will help them continue to pursue their career goals. In some cases, their career may take new turns or they may choose to redefine themselves and goals. So, whatever phase a person may be in in their career, taking the time to plan will help to keep them focused and on that goal. Thank you.